everybody, it's Karen. I'm showing a really fun mini album today. I made it for a little girl. Um, her name's Gabby, G-A-B-Y. She's eight years old. Um, she is a little girl that my daughter mentors through the Big Brothers, Big Sisters um, a program up in New England. My daughter has a couple more weeks with her and then they won't see each other again until the fall. And she's had eight-year-old Gabby now for two school years. So she has one more, one more year left with her while she's in college. Um, so when my daughter Erin sees her in a couple weeks, this will be like her going away for the summer gift. And I was told she likes Elsa, bunnies, and puppies, so I went ahead and made a Frozen album for her. It measures 8 by 6, and the pages are 5 and a half by 7 and a half. I use paper from the EK um, Success Frozen Pack, and you can find that at Walmart. Um, I did add a little bling to the cover. Here's some blue glitter tool, and this is just ribbon. I think I probably got it at Joann's or Walmart. Here on the spine, I use some We Are Memory Keepers denim paper. It looks like little snowballs. And there's more pretty paper on the back from the collection. On the spine, I put some tool on, on one of these like um, brads with some um, frozen colored ribbon. And then I made three charms out of bottle caps. I don't know if you can see them. Um, here's like the springtime castle. Um, here's Olaf and the two sisters here. And I did put a few beads um, to decorate them. So the album is made for an eight-year-old. And my daughter asked me um, not to make it complicated with a lot of hidden flaps and, you know, pockets. Make it so Gabby could add her own pictures and decorate it. So I did make um, some embellishments, and I'm going to show them to you also. The front's plain for an eight-year-old and her mom, just to put a picture here. The same with the first page. I have four pocket pages and then two flat pages for some of the bigger pages on the 12 by 12 pack to show. So the pocket pages have just pattern paper for a nice photo or photos. And on the back I use black cardstock. I did use like a, a little fist, no, an EK Success punch here. And I got her some metallic um, um, Crayola shimmering uh, pencils for her to color. Um, my daughter Erin said she likes to draw. So there's four of these pullouts for her. So on the next page, I did decorate a little bit. I um, made about 20 photo mats out of this um, wonky stitch die from Avery L. Um, and I glued down two of them in the book and the rest are for her to finish. Here's some, um, I punched out um, some snowflakes and put some gems on them to show her to, that's easy to do. These are tree cutouts that I cut out from my Cricut and I have a whole bag of them for her from pattern from the collection. And this is just a heart punch that I put blue tool over and a snowflake and some um, scotch um, blue glitter tape. I think it looks really cute. Um, so here's a one of the two flat pages over here. So she can put a picture here. And here's like a bigger 12 by 12 um, piece of paper that I wanted the whole scene to be on here. So she put a picture up here and over here. And here a picture of Anna. More place for a photo. Another place to draw and put a photo. And here we have Olaf. I actually haven't seen Frozen yet. It's one movie I do want to see eventually. Um, here is another uh, flap that I decorated with like a blue glitter heart and Olaf and I put some snowflakes up here and these are left open so the a photo will slide um, fit back there. One of the bigger pieces of paper I wanted to use. And here's a pull out. And then one more plain page. So it's kind of plain, but I want it to be interactive for her. And so what I got at the store for her to um, complete her album with some stickers. Here we have Elsa and Olaf and some 
Anna stickers. I showed you the pencils I got her. I also got her some blue gemstones to add to her pictures and some pretty diamond colored ones. And then um, I cut out a bunch of hearts and on a handful of them I decorated them with glitter tape and some I glued together. Um, I put some fringe on some these are all so she can add them to her drawings or her photos. And I also made her a whole bag of tags um, for her to write on. Um, just white and black cardstock with blue and um, white um, frozen colors. And I made, I have a whole baggie full of snowflakes, blue, light blue, dark blue, white, some glitter, mostly glitter. And then I also have a whole baggie full of hearts from the paper collection that she can um, um, decorate with these. And then here is a whole baggie full of um, trees, like I think there's four or five different patterns from the paper to put on the side of her photos. And I have more stickers from her. These are left over from the bottle caps. And I have a whole baggie full of um, wonky shaped um, cutouts. And then I um, went ahead and got glue so it's easy for her and her mom to finish the album. So tell me what you think. I know it's a little bit on the plain side, but I think it's really interactive for an eight-year-old, and I think she'll have a good time with it. Um, thanks a lot, everybody.